What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video guys. Hope all of you guys are doing very well. So guys, I'm making some meat right now on the barbecue. Some chicken breasts, uh, drumstick, uh, thighs I guess you could say. It's a bit deep, it's like frosted so it's kind of stuck together. But pretty much, I just wanna make a video to you guys about why uh, veganism or being a vegan or eating just vegetables in general, at least most of your diet is a psyop and fake and it's making you weak and just uh, basically a slave to the system, the government, and you're just uh, basically doing yourself a disservice to yourself, your future generation, uh, your family, like just your health in general. Because guys, me, this piece right here, it has so much, uh, you know, good protein, BC, double A's, yeah, brand training amino acids. And when you eat uh, vegetables, or sorry, I got, I got uh, interrupted there. But yeah, so meat, guys, eating vegan plant-based diet is just a psyop. It's making you weak. And uh, like guys, you aren't getting the best amount of protein. Um, you aren't satiating yourself that you should be. Like, especially if you're trying to lose weight. When you eat a lot of plant-based stuff or just like vegetables, um, you aren't satiating yourself. So that means you'll feel more hungry. Uh, you aren't getting the best quality of protein, food in general. And like guys, like personally for me, I'll, I'll give you guys my like uh, testimony when it comes to eating meat or just like a plant-based uh, in, in general diet. Whenever I don't eat meat guys, like I have to eat meat at least once a day or so. If I don't eat meat, um, I literally feel so horrible during the day. I feel, I feel too hungry. Like if I, don't eat, if I don't eat a type of meat or at least a big, like a full carb diet or a meal, I can't work out properly. Also that's because, you know, carbs fill your muscles and everything like that. But when you eat mostly like, uh, vegetables, plant-based stuff, you just don't feel as good. And many, millions of people feel the same way. And that's why the government, the systems, and everyone, you know, that's tied to that is trying to push this agenda of eating the bugs only, uh, removing meat. Like, I think there's protests in France right now because the government wants to, like, uh, do something about the meat. I'm not too educated on that, so I'm not going to speak too much on that. But yeah, there's just a big agenda against meat, guys. It's no, it's no, um, it's no coincidence that what they're doing is, you know, to save the environment. No, they just want to keep people weak, poor, hungry. Like, guys, this is all a psyop. I won't say too much before you know, YouTube gets in the way of, uh, you know, striking me down or you know, trying to enforce some stupid, stupid violation on my channel. Because on my gaming channel, which you guys don't know, I, I, I play games here and there i post on there as well shane crazy but yeah like if you say like a certain thing they'll just send to you like it it's just stupid guys like all this is so sad that's why i like elon musk because he's actually bringing free speech to um to to the media and that's gonna just change how the, this election goes this year 2024 and more elections and other you know political and just stuff in the world goes on in the future so shout out to Elon Musk for that. I don't agree with everything he does, you know, with Neuralink, you know, Mark of the Beast, stuff like that. Shout out to all my brothers in Christ, Christian sisters, you guys know exactly what I'm talking about, the Mark of the Beast. I don't mess with that stuff. But other than that, I mean, he's doing a lot of good for the world, guys, Elon Musk. But yeah, guys, meat, you need to eat your meat. I'm not against eating fruits or vegetables. I'm all for eating a mixed-based diet, but if I was to go to one specific diet, it would be, um, Probably paleo, paleo, where you only eat meat, you don't eat anything else. Guys, look, look how good this looks. I know all the vegans and other people are cringing right now, but guys. And guys, a lot of plants and stuff you eat, animals have to die for that stuff in order for it to be grown and uh, just be produced. I'm not too educated on that, so I probably shouldn't be getting into this when I don't know my facts right. But how, uh, you know, certain plants and... Uh, stuff like that are made and how animals some animals or insects do die for that you am pretty sure bees i don't know exactly exactly how but they die whenever they try to produce some type of uh, uh plant or, or stuff like that but pretty much guys it's, it's it's just like you're doing yourself a disservice and also your future generation because when if you do decide to have kids they're not gonna have as peak or as good genetics as if they were to eat meat like you know what i'm saying so you're just doing yourself a disservice along with your future generations to come if you do decide to have children which is something that a lot of people aren't going to have nowadays due to the, also the style of feminism and uh you know the war against men stuff like that that's, whole, that's another video for another time guys but yeah pretty much guys just make sure you eat your meats 
have a mixed diet. I like to eat vegetables too, like Brussels sprouts, broccoli, cauliflower, carrots, stuff like that. Also fruits like, you know, strawberry, banana. I, I love eating a banana every day, like one or two. But I love to eat my meat. Like I'll be eating this with like some uh, brown or basmati rice or white jasmine rice or just white rice with meat. And also, you know, maybe a little lasagna, which has ground beef, cheese, you know, stuff like that. And also with macaroni pie, guys, just eat everything. Don't listen to these vegans and uh, vegetarians. Like when it comes from an ethical perspective, guys, like your ancestors wouldn't be here if it wasn't for me. They have to hunt and eat meat. Obviously they ate vegetables and fruits too, but they have to eat meat in order to survive as well. Like meat is needed, guys. You wouldn't be here right now if it wasn't for me. So stop lying to yourself that you can't eat meat. Meat's not good for you. It sucks for the animals when they die. That's, that's how life is, guys. If you're Christian like me, Animals are meant to be slaughtered and killed in order for you to live on. That's a circle of life. That's a circle of life, guys. That's how. That's how it goes. Animals have to get breathed and then eventually slaughtered and you know butchered in order for you to eat and survive and be healthy for you, your family, and other generations to come. That's just all how it works, guys. Yeah. So, well, obviously, guys, if you have an autoimmune disease, then of course, of course, you know. And you have to eat vegan and you can't eat meat because it'll trigger you know something with your genetics or i don't know your inflammatory markers but that makes sense like i think michaela peterson i mean she's the opposite she has to eat meat in order for her to not have like arthritis because she's like i think she's autoimmune auto autoimmune disease with arth arthritis or something like that so she has to eat meat and certain foods and then she eats other stuff like that and might trigger it so for some people it'll be the opposite where they can't eat meat because it'll trigger something with their autoimmune disease if that's the case and you're like you're an exception to the rule but other than that, guys, you should be eating a mixed-based diet with new vegetables, uh, you know, quality protein, quality carbs, you know, good carbs, good fats, which meat has, like, this has a lot of it found here. And yeah, guys, so if y'all did enjoy this video, guys, be sure to like and also subscribe. I'll be making, I'll be still making the workout videos, but this is, you know, I, I, love, I love making these sit-down videos of me just explaining my point of view on certain topics of things in the world. So guys, if y'all did enjoy, man, be sure to like and also subscribe. Thank you so much. So thank you so much for watching, guys. God bless. I'll catch y'all next video. Peace.